Hi, my name is Anne. I use she, her pronouns. I am from South Burlington, Vermont. I am a bio major in the College of Arts and Sciences, also in the Honors College. And my favorite spot on campus is the green roof outside of the Honors College. It's a really good spot where in the spring and summer, uh, we soak up the sun, we do our homework there, we'll go outside and have picnics and play sports. And during the winter, it's closed, but right before they closed it, we all made, we went out there and made snowmen. Um, so it's just a really good spot to be outside and enjoy doing your homework um, and be with friends. I love living in the Honors Residential College. I think that it's in the perfect location on campus because it's not too far from everything that's happening, but it's also not too close so you feel like um, there's too much happening around you and you can't escape. Also, I think that the main thing that stands out to me about living in the Honors College is the community and the people that you're living with. Um, I honestly was a little worried about the Honors College feeling too competitive and like everyone would always be studying and it wouldn't be any fun, but that's so far from the truth. Yes, I can always find someone to study with. I can always find someone who would be willing to look over my paper, um, to help me with the chem lab, to help me study for the bio exam. Um, you know, when a big test is coming up, I can always walk into any of the study rooms and find someone who's also studying and wants to study together. You know, we all want each other to do well. It's not a competition. We're all lifting each other up, which I think is an amazing and healthy environment to be in. But also at the end of the day, we're college students and the Honors College kids don't forget that. Um, I've made some of the best friends of my life here living in the Honors College. You know, we'll go skiing on the weekends together. We'll go on hikes. We eat all our meals together. But also if you want to study, they don't make you feel bad for you know wanting to leave a social environment to go do that but they also are a great support system at the end of a hard week we'll all you know huddle into the common room together and watch a movie on the projector so it's just such such a great great environment I also think the Honors College has a lot of support and you know living in the residential college um, it's just really nice to be in the center of that you know, there's chemistry sessions right before big chem exams. There's writing tutor sessions where they'll look over your um, age call papers. There'll be yoga during stressful times in the um, multi-purpose room, you know, right around course registration. There was someone out in the lobby that was willing to help you. There was coffee set up and snacks. So it's just a really great place for you to have support and to never feel overwhelmed with your classes. Uh, one time I came back and Dean Jenneman had made apple crisp for everyone in age call. It was just such a great thing to come back to. Um, and there's just not a lack of support. You can always find someone who's willing to help you out um, if you're struggling with anything. Also, living in age call, your honors college class is right there in the dorms, which is super nice. My honors college classes were always my first class of the day. So I always, you know, go down in my slippers and with a cup of tea, have a great class and a great discussion and then go up to my dorm and get ready for the day. I think that it's great having that one class. Um, in the dorms, but then also being able to, you know, go onto central campus and go into the other buildings. It's really a really, really great balance. Also, just in general, the Honors College is a super nice dorm. Um, I honestly think that the, it's not the nicest first year dorms. Um, you know, you get your own bathrooms, which I think is a huge perk. Also in the lobby, there's a kitchen where all of my friends and I will make dinner together sometimes and dessert. And it's just a really great bonding experience for all of us. There's a fireplace in the lobby, which is really nice. We'll all um, sit around and play cards. So all in all, I would highly, highly recommend living in the Honors Residential College. It's been probably the best decision I've made coming to UVM, and I think you should too. So I actually decided to go random um, coming into the Honors College. I was actually really worried about going random because I was worried that I wouldn't like my roommate and I wasn't sure what that was going to be like. But living in South Burlington, I didn't want to, um, you know, choose someone that I already knew because I wanted to branch out and make new friends. And I knew that living in the dorms with someone new would be the best way to do that. I was also a little hesitant about using Facebook just because, you know, sometimes people aren't always what they seem like on social media. So I decided to go random and it's been the best decision I ever made. 
I would recommend to anyone to go random. I think UVM does a great job at matching you up with um, people that have similar habits to you. I'm actually in a triple right now. Um, and I love my roommates and I love my living situation. One of my roommates and I are best friends. We do everything together. We're in the same friend group. We eat all of our meals together. We're living together next year. Um, she's honestly been like the biggest support system to me as you know coming in as a first year and I'm so grateful that I found her just by going random. Our other roommate we're not as close with but we still have a great great relationship. You know we'll sometimes eat meals together. Um, she's also a bio major so we'll work together on homework and labs. Um, she was able to have a car on campus this year because she has a horse so we went and we visited her horse and she'll offer to bring us back groceries and stuff like that. So it's really been a great dynamic. I've met my best friend in the entire world um, going random. And I also met another great just, you know, person to have in my life and support with my classes. So I would highly recommend going random if you're worried about it. There's nothing to be worried about. And it's also very easy to switch up your living situation um, if it's not what you're looking for.